pH at the equivalence point. We titrate 45 milliliters of an acidic solution of HA with a 0.23 molar solution of BaOH2. If we need 52.4 milliliters of the solution of BaOH2 to titrate the acid, what was the concentration of HA? If the Ka value for HA is 8.8 .8 times 10 to the negative 13, what is the value of the pH at the equivalence point? First, let's write the balanced equation. In this acid-base titration, we add the same number of moles of base that there were of acid in the solution. This concept is what allows us to build the classic titration equation, CAVA equals CBVB. Don't forget to add the coefficient. Looking at the equation, we see that we need two moles of base to neutralize one mole of acid. Two OH- ions can come from each BaOH2 to react with the H plus ions from the acid HA. Another way of thinking of it is imagining that the given concentration is that of the whole molecule. But here, the only important parts for the titration are the OH- and the H plus of the molecules. So, for BaOH2, the concentration of the OH- ions would be two times greater than the concentration of the whole molecule. We insert the values of the concentration and volume given in the question. Since we will multiply and then divide by the volume, we can keep these values in milliliters because they will have the same ratios as they would when transferred into liters. We round our answer to three significant digits due to the precision of the data in the question. The coefficient 2 has an infinite number of significant digits. The original concentration of HA is 0.536 moles per liter. The second part of the question asks for the pH at the equivalence point. At this point, more and more base has been added until there are no more H plus ions for them to react with. They have all been neutralized. Water and BaA2 are the products, and they are all that's left in the solution. Note that BaA2 is actually three separate ions in solution, but for the equation, we write them as a complete molecule. The A- ions are weak bases and will dissociate a little bit in water. We will make an ice table. First, let's do the calculations for the dilution. Because 52.4 milliliters of base are added and add to the total volume of the solution, the initial concentration is diluted. However, there are still the same amount of moles of solute before and after the dilution. So we can use this little equation. We insert the concentration of the acid that we just calculated because at the equivalence point, there are the same number of moles of A- that there were originally of HA. We put in the version of the answer with a lot of significant digits to avoid rounding errors. The final volume will be the volume of the acid and the base that was added. This is the concentration of A- in solution at the equivalence point. We will write the equation for the dissociation of A- and create an ice table. We insert the diluted concentration of our base. A certain quantity of moles x will dissociate in the aqueous solution. Now we need to determine the value of x. The question only gave us the Ka, and since we're looking at the dissociation of the base, we need the Kb. Now that we have the Kb, we can build our equation for the equilibrium constant. We insert our values for the concentrations. We are able to ignore the subtraction of x from the original concentration of A- if the concentration of x is less than 5% of the original concentration. Let's check if we can use the 5% rule. No, our change value is not less than 5%, so we will need to take the subtraction into consideration and use the quadratic equation. We need to put all the terms onto one side, Next, we can put our values into the quadratic equation. A negative concentration of OH- is impossible, so we ignore this answer. The concentration of OH- is 0.04764 moles per liter. Now we just need to solve for the pH. We will find the pOH first, then the pH. We could have also found the concentration of H+, and then the pH if you had liked. We round the answer to two significant digits, because the Ka only had two significant digits. 
The pH is 12.68.